Welcome. In this video we will talk about the history and origin about this surname. The surname Aguilan is a name whose history on English soil dates back to the wave of migration that followed the Norman conquest of England of 1066. The Aguilan family lived in the parish of St. Marie de la Haye d'Aguilan, which was granted in 1213 by Philip de Vassy to Jordan, Bishop of Bayou, on the foundation of his Abbey of Monday. Robert d'Aguilan and his son witness a charter of Stephen, Count of Chartres, in 1100. Roger Seculius, a subtenant in the Exon Doomsday, is believed to be the ancestor of the English house, which first became of note in the reign of Cur de Lyon. One of the first on record was Manser or Manasser de Aguilan, who obtained from the king a confirmation of his land, and died before 1194, when Godfrey de Saint Martin paid 100 pounds for license to marry Constance, his widow, with her inheritance. Aguilan from England is a surname that was first found in Cumberland where they were lords of the manor of Aglianby from very ancient times. They were descended from Renulf, Earl of Carlisle. Lord of Cumberland and Carlisle, who exchanged the earldom of Chester for that of Carlisle. The earls of Chester were previously Viscounts of Besson in the department of Calvados in Normandy. The first in Cumberland about 1150 was Walter de Aguilin. The township of Linstock in Cumberland was home to the family in later years. Walter de Aguilin came to Cumberland in the train of Earl Renulf de Meschines and gave his name to his dwelling place, still called the Manor of Aguilin or Aglianby. His descendants remained till 1785, when Christopher Aglianby died a bachelor in the flower of his age, the last of the male line of this ancient family. This surname may have several different spelling variations, such as the following. Many English families left England to avoid the chaos of their homeland and migrated to the many British colonies abroad. Although the conditions on the ships were extremely cramped, and some travelers arrived diseased, starving, and destitute, once in the colonies, many of the families prospered and made valuable contributions to the cultures of what would become the United States and Canada. Research into the origins of individual families in North America has revealed records of the immigration of a number of people bearing the name Aguilan, or a variant listed above, will Aglianby be settled in Georgia, no date was recorded.